Mom, Sheldon can't find his bow tie. Really? I laid it out for him. Leave it alone, Mary. He doesn't need a bow tie. It's his first day of school. Let him wear what he wants. Mom, I can't find my bow tie. Dear Lord, why has he got to wear a bow tie? Can I drive in with you? Sure. Everybody's going to know he's your brother. It's going to be awful for you. Tell her to shut up. She's not wrong. It's got to be here. It's not. It's not. Tell it. Yeah, stay calm. We'll find it. My tie is gone. My tie is gone. Kelly, you don't really need a tie. I have to find my tie. I have to find my tie. Be right back. Professor Proton wears a bow tie. George Jr., give me back that bow tie right now. I didn't take don't it. Don't you lie to me. I'm not lying. We'll see about that. Stay out of my room. She's going to find your dirty magazines. Shut up. You are not having a good day. Oh. Hey, hey, he didn't take it. Then what happened to it? I took it. Why would you do that? Mary, the boy is nine years old and going into high school. Isn't that weird enough? Give it to me. Come on, it's not just Sheldon. Georgie's going to be in class with him. Give it. Would you like to play a driving game? Not really. I always lose. I know. That's why it's fun. <laughs> How about license plates with prime numbers followed by a constant? Why don't we just talk? Very well. You understand that some people are going to be intimidated by you because of how smart you are? Or maybe they'll recognize my intellect and make me their leader. Lord, look after my son. Don't let him get stuffed in a gym bag. Oh, dear. Yeah. That boy has an exposed tattoo. He does. I wonder if he knows that's in violation of the dress code. Speaking of which, how about we lose the bow tie? Why? Look around, honey. None of the other kids are wearing one. Well, perhaps I'll start a fad. No, you won't. Please trust Mommy. All right, tell you what. You take it off, and this weekend, I'll take you to Radio Shack. Mm-hmm.